students welcome all of you once again to the online classes for language skills which is a compulsory paper for semester 1 bsc bcom ba communicative english in this series of videos we are watching and listening to various parts of the textbook language skills and today's video we are going to see module 2 lesson 2 of the textbook phonetics ready reckoner which is there in the language skills textbook pray with the article in the video phonetics ready reckoner and the lesson on of you are not familiar with terms like phonetics and phonology these are some of the terms that students of English language and literature are more familiar to you however in this video I'm trying to give you an understanding of what is phonetics and what's the definition of phonetics and then some understanding of phonology in English uh, screen you can now see some unfamiliar writing what is it is it the alphabet in english or is it some other uh, script or alphabets in some other language no it is phonetic script a word written in phonetic script Ibadat nengal kana na, ini wak yang dahana. Macam tu, bahasa ini le, waku alagil alfabetu ala, maracu. English le dene, uru wakin de, uccha arana. Madah phonetic scriptil erdiri kana. This is pronounced as phonetics, phonetics. Then what is phonetics? What is phonetics the word phonetics come it comes from the Greek word phone the meaning of phone we know it's sound or voice and the the the, the part of the word ticks means study so it's a study of sounds so it is uh, phonetics is a theory about human speech sounds that we use in speaking how they are pronounced transmitted and received studies about the production of speech sounds speech sound Nirmanam, Enginiana, speech sound, then transmission of speech sounds. Vidu Victida Wild Nunum Varana, Vidu Victiundakuna, Nurmikina, speech sound, Enginiana, Sanjari Kadal. Then it also studies about reception of it. How the listener listens to that and how he receives it. That also comes under the study of phonetics. Then, the smallest sound unit, such as a simple vowel or consonant sound, is called phoneme. Phonetics will tanne, nammala padikinna, etevum chariya khadagam. Etevum chariya shabdathinne unit ne nammala, the word cat, c-a-t, cat. So, when you pronounce it, we are not considering the alphabet of it. Instead, we consider the sound of it. 
K, K is the first sound, A is the second sound, and T is the third sound. So there are three sounds. Okay, and in phonetics, the smallest sound unit we call it is for phoneme. Phoneme. So the mala bharam. Bharatin de tum charia unit and dana gram in the third day mula unit and dalla. The name number and dana were another milligram and the very other valiana if for Nemo. should study phonetics the first reason is or the first intention is to give you a true description of sounds of English and how they are made it gives you a true description of sounds of English language and how they are made second to differentiate sounds of English from those of the mother tongue. Third, to help you to improve your English accent, your listening skills and your ability to communicate effectively with others. Then finally, to point out the mistakes in learners' pronunciation and help them learn the correct form. So, English speech sounds. When you listen to a native speaker, then you feel some kind of difficulty in understanding what he is speaking. You fail to digest certain words uttered by the person. Why is that? It happens because you are not familiar to the English speech sounds. Namaka English area, but she other English pasha or native speaker some side it. Namala digging created till the good of the name. Sherikim or native speaker English some side it. Kimbol are adeham upevikana shabdangal namakatra parijida malla. You should really know what are all the speech sounds of English. And then you need to differentiate speech sounds in English from speech sounds in your mother tongue. Our mother tongue is Malayalam. In Malayalam, we are all familiar with Malayalam words. But there is some kind of difference. There are differences between the sounds in English and the sounds in Malayalam. So, you need to understand it. The Hanathana C-A-T, we call it cat. Scat. That A is not familiar to us. So, we say cat. Cat. It's in phonetics in English will improve your English accent. What is the meaning of accent? Accent means the up and downs of or the variation of of the rhythm of 
uttering an English sentence. Namlo oru English sentence. Adha parayam bol, samsari kum bol. Adha ne agathun daagunna yetta korachiligal. Wave differences. Adha ne ana sadha namlo accent na oli kudal. Namlo Malayalam thinne accent ne mai vallare familiar ana. Pachi. Namlo English samsari kum bolum. Aa English. Oru Malayalam accent ila iri kum namlo samsari kum bol. So you may be heard about neutral accent. Neutral accent means no accent. the first category in some detail that is the production of speech sounds so in the production of speech sounds there are certain organs in our body that play a very important role in the production of speech sounds so you are all very much familiar to them for example tongue Tongue has a special purpose. What is it? Speech. Production of speech. And in addition to tongue, there are some other organs that we call as organs of speech. Some kind of knowledge about these speech organs. I told you tongue is a speech organ. And lips, two lips, upper lip and lower lip. Then teeth. Teeth means the front teeth. Lower teeth ridge and the upper teeth ridge. Then uh, trachea. Then larynx. Oral cavity. Na nasal cavity. Alveolar ridge. These are all speech organs we call them as speech organs because in one or another way it influences the production of speech particular lesson that you need to study there is some kind of information about the international phonetic alphabet we call it as IPA International Phonetic Alphabet IPA See in English there is one there is no one to one relation between the system of writing and the system of pronunciation it's a big issue i will explain it
it may have different sounds likewise you take the letter C what is it what is the sound of it sometimes the letter C has the sound K and sometimes the letter C has the sound CH so we cannot definitely tell what what is its sound sometimes some of the letters are silent in words so that's why we call it that's why we say that there is no one to one relationship between the English alphabet and its corresponding sound so it's a big problem then the alphabet which we use to write in English has 26 letters but in standard British English there are approximately 44 sounds you know we have only 26 letters in English and with the 26 letters we need to make 44 sounds but what about in Malayalam we have 56 letters in Malayalam and we make 56 sounds in Malayalam but in English 26, 26 letters and 44 speech sounds so it's a big very very big issue that's why by listening to the sound of a word we cannot predict what about the spelling that come so we need to study and by heart a particular word spelling when we study that word Namala Malayala Tilu Waka Gatala Namaka Shabda Manasarichu Waka Eridan Patu Uri Kilimidi Tila Tavaka Anakilim A Shabda Manasarich Namakeda Pache English Angane Patigi Lakarnam Uri Kilangal Namak Padichitula Arrange to La Waka Ortho Namakeda And a Shabdan Kalkamboida Pache Pududa Eri Waka Anangi It will not be very easy for you to write the Spelling of that word. The in International Phonetic Alphabet, or otherwise IPA, is a pronunciation alphabet in which every speech sound is represented by a symbol. IPA consists of all the speech sounds in the world. Whether it's Malayalam, whether, whether it's Hindi, Tamil or anything. All the speech sounds are represented in IPA. So, don't think that the IPA includes only the speech sounds in English. It includes all the speech sounds in the universe. The symbols are used in modern dictionaries for English learners. When, when you consult a dictionary, along the word, phonetic script of it, or the, by using international phonetic alphabet, is represented. Pronunciation in English or speech sounds in English. In English, we have 26 letters. And of 26 letters... we have 44 sounds by making use of 26 letters we make 44 sounds see in 26 letters we have 5 vowel letters and 21 consonant letters nammala school il thana padichirundu anj vowels aanu ullathu adu pole 21 consonants aanu ullathu nammal padichirundu Pache Manasilakula, Anchi Vavilil, Anchi Vavil alphabet sana. Adabole, Iribatun, consonants or another, Iribatun, consonant letters sana. Speech sound galla. When you come to study about the sounds or speech sounds in English, we have forty four speech sounds. Nalpati nala. Samsara alengil ucharana shabdangalunda, English. 
So of 44 speech sounds, 12 are vowels. 12 are vowels. 8 are diphthongs. And 24 are consonant sounds. So of 44 speech sounds, 12 are pure vowels. We call them as pure vowels. And 8 are diphthongs. 24 are con English samsara bhashil or English speech sound. Nalpatiala speech sound. Adela Pandranam te namla. Pure vowels in Nana Bara another. Pantran Shesham Uru Yetanam Adane diphthongs and Nana Bara another. Sherikin Namala Parainbo, I Pandrandum Yetungada Kutiana Bubbles and Vara another. Pandrandum Yetum Iribada Pum Iriba the Vavalegalonda but e Iriba the Vavalegala Pantrandanam Pure Vavalsum eight etanum diphthongulmana. Diphthongal vowels are not pure vowels. Now, we need to consonant sounds. So, together, 44 speech sounds. There are 12 pure vowels. Pure vowels are also called as monophthongs. Shutta maitula vowels. See, uh, they are E as in read. Read le E I to la E sound. Then in the word sit, there is an E. E as in sit. Then U. U as in book. Book. U. U sound. Then there is a long U. To that U sound. Then a as in men. Then other difficult sound that's that's we call it as a a as in America. In order to understand better listening to various speech sounds in English, I will give you a link to certain number of videos that you can watch and understand the, about the speech sounds in English. So you will get more familiar with them. Group of words. Then there are a group of sounds that we call as diphthongs diphthongs there are eight diphthongs in english c e a see it starts from one diphthong and moves to another diphthong e a as in here a as in day u a as in to a boy as in See, oi as in boy, o as in go, ye as in via, i as in my, o as in how. So these are diphthong sounds. So two vowel position are there. Iretash of the Nalaka Paraya Malayalatilla. The gender name Dandaki Matam Patilla E. Siamis Irretala Polanum E. Shabda Omai to Verilla. The legend of Vaval Sunda Uruwakuchi Gimbal Nakinde position 
ഒരു വവ്വൽ പൊസിഷനിൽ നിന്ന് പെട്ടെന്ന് മറ്റൊരു വവൽ പൊസിഷനിലേക്ക് വഴുതി മാറും വി കോൾ ദ മാസ് വവൽ ഗ്ലൈഡ്സ് വവൽ ഗ്ലൈഡ്സ് ദ ടങ് ഗ്ലൈഡ്സ് ഫ്രം വൺ വവൽ പൊസിഷൻ ടു അനദർ ദാറ്റ്സ് വൈ വി കോൾ ദ മാസ് വവൽ ഗ്ലൈഡ്സ് നമുക്ക് ഡിഫ്താങ്ങുകളെ വവൽ ഗൈഡ്സ് ഗ്ലൈഡ്സ് എന്ന് വിളിക്കാം can see 24 consonant sounds consonant sounds there are 24 consonant sounds so these are the counts con- consonant sounds p as in pig b as in bad t as in time d as in do ch as in church and j as in judge k as in kilo g as in go f as in five w as in very th as in think d as in the s as in six z as in zoo sh as in short casual j as in casual m as in milk n as in no hello l as in live r as in rat w as in winter y as in yes 24 consonant sounds ee oru shabdangaleyum nammala consonant sounds nanu vilikkunathu aa nammala oru sound kandathu pole p p ana sound പിഗ്ഗിനകത്ത് പിഗ് എന്ന വേർഡിനകത്തുള്ള പ് സൗണ്ട് ആണ് പ് എന്ന ആ സിമ്പിൾ റെപ്രസെൻ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നത് അതുപോലെ ബെഡ് എന്ന വാക്കിലെ ബ് ആസ് ഇൻ ബെഡ് ബ് ആണ് ട് ആസ് ഇൻ ടൈം ഡ് ആസ് ഇൻ ഡു ആസ് ഇൻ ചേർച്ച് ചേർച്ച് judge j as in judge k k as in kilo g g as in go f as in five v as in very th th as in think think d d as in the s as in six z z as in zoo zoo then sh as in short ka j j as in casual m as in milk n as in no ing as in sing h h as in hello l as in leaf r as in rat v as in winter y as in yes so ingane namukku oro shabdangalayum identify cheyan pattum chart you can see all the english speech sounds represented in international phonetic alphabet nammal ivide kaanuna 44 sounds vowels 20 that means pure vowels and diphthongs together then 20 consonants all together 44 sounds are represented here they are represented in international phonetic alphabet sim- symbols ായിട്ട് വ്യക്തമായി മനസ്സിലാക്കാനും പഠിക്കാനും ആവശ്യമായിട്ടുള്ള ലിങ്കുകൾ ഞാൻ ഈ വീഡിയോയുടെ കൂടെ ഷെയർ ചെയ്യുന്നതായിരിക്കും സോ അതിലേക്ക് പോകുമ്പോൾ നിങ്ങൾ കൂടുതൽ ഈ ഫനറ്റിക് സ്ക്രിപ്റ്റ്സിനെ പറ്റിയും വവൽസിനെയും കൺസണൻസിനെ പറ്റിയും ഡിഫ്തോങ്ങളെ പറ്റിയൊക്കെ വളരെ നന്നായിട്ട് മനസ്സിലാക്കാൻ പറ്റും വാച്ചിങ് ദിസ് വീഡിയോ hope that you enjoyed it will come 
with another video until then goodbye to all so in this video we discussed certain parts of the lesson phonetics you already reckon if you have any doubts or clarification to be made please uh, open up with your questions thank you for all watching this video we'll come with the other parts of the textbook until then goodbye